Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. For those of you who are new here, this is Making It Happen with Mary and I am Mary. Today's video, you guys, don't mind my hair today. It's looking a little crazy. It's like a lion's mane today, guys. I just can't seem to tame her today. She's just being crazy, yo. But today's video, I wanted to talk to you guys about Juniper Breeze. Y'all, this is such an underrated scent. I am absolutely in love with Juniper Breeze. I have been for years. But I wanted to talk to her and do a little bit of a review, a little bit of a comparison, because you guys know why. If you've been watching me for a while, you know why. But anyway, scent notes on Juniper Breeze. This is an older packaging, by the way. This one is from 2021. Scent notes, Juniper Leaves, Green Apple, Blue Jasmine, Fresh Woods, and Dewey Musk. I love this one. Yes. Never fails, I swear to God, every time I sit down in here to record, he's got to poke his head in here. I think he just likes being on camera. That's what I really think. That's what I think. But anyway, let's get back to my girl here. I absolutely love this scent. It's a fresh scent, believe it or not. Um, Juniper has a piney type of a scent to it. But what's cool about this one is that you also get that green apple. So like piney type of a scent with green apple. Say what? But it works. It works so well. Yeah, and you do get the jasmine with a little bit of musk and wood in the background. I love this scent. It's very, it's a sweeter take on fresh, in my opinion. I know it's hard to believe sweeter considering piney, musk, dew, you know, whatever. But that green apple really sweetens this sucker up. Oh, it's so freaking good. I, From what I'm hearing and what I've known of people in the past, they either love this or they hate it. It doesn't seem to be any middle ground with this one. This is one of the fresh scents that I adore. Like, I absolutely adore this one. But let's compare her because I have a couple here that I wanted to be like, let's really suss this out. And the first one is Sea Island Shore because this is a fresh scent. Scent notes are clean cotton, orange blossom, blue freesia, and ocean, 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 ocean musk, musk. And this is most definitely not the same. This is like a fresh scent. I didn't really even start liking this until recently. Look at that. And look at the dent I already put in. I'm like, damn. I don't really get cotton from this. And the little bit of cotton I do get is so tiny. It's in the background. What I mostly get is that blue freesia and the ocean blossom, which this is a fresh scent, but it leans more toward like oceanic air fresh. You know what I'm saying? Yes. Like actually, I the more I smell this, the more it reminds me of light blue intense from Dolce & Gabbana. Yeah, yeah. Like this, I think would layer lovely with light blue intense. But again, that's an oceanic vibe and this is not oceanic whatsoever. So are these two the same and not even in the same category, y'all? Totally, totally, totally different. Much more aquatic, this one. Now we also have a white t-shirt, which if you've been watching me for any length of time, you know I do not like white t-shirt. As you can see, there is still a ton in here and there probably will be a ton in here until the end of time. So, but let's just read. The scent notes are crisp pear, fresh white t-shirt, lavender cloud, clean musk, and soft sandalwood. You would think with that sandalwood note in there that I would love this, and I don't. No, I don't, I don't, I don't at all. I don't at all, like, no, no. This to me is like straight up laundry, like, dryer sheet let me just stick my face in the dryer sheets and although i love that for the laundry room i don't want to smell like that so yeah it's just too fresh too laundry detergent too now my daughter would probably love this she she loves scents like this yeah, I just can't get into it. It's too, too fresh. It's literally laundry detergent, in my opinion. Laundry sheets, totally, totally different. Nothing like Juniper Breeze. Completely different. Yeah. I keep this for comparison purposes because that's the only reason I would have it, to be honest. I ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna lie. 
Yeah, yeah, um, not my jam, baby, not my jam. The last one I wanted to compare this to, y'all, I fell in love with this one from Victoria's Secret recently. It came out earlier this year, and it is Aloe Water and Hibiscus. I mean, at least I think it was. I don't recall seeing this one before in their line until this past spring when I picked it up. In fact, if you look at one of my, like, Shop Along With Me vlogs, we went to the mall, and I ended up picking this up. Yeah, I love it. Scent notes. It says, refresh with the scent of aloe water and hibiscus, botanical inspiration, pure invigoration. Yeah. This is definitely a very fresh scent, but the aloe warms this up and gives us such a unique, almost like spa-like quality, almost like spa-like quality. It reminds me of a high-end spa, and I love it. Um, I don't really get hibiscus from this, like any type of a hibiscus flower or anything, any type of floral. It literally, to me, kind of smells like a little bit of cucumber in the background, but predominantly aloe in the front, and I love it. It's very, very spa, fresh, beautiful, light, tranquil, get, puts you like in a good place of mind. I could see sniffing this and being like, Goose Fraba. You know what I mean? <laughs> and if you know what Goose Fraba is or what movie that's from, leave me a comment down below because I want to know who's on their game out there. But yeah. Yeah. I definitely do enjoy this one a lot. I love it. Um, but is it like Juniper Breeze? No. I, I think this is much more like spa, zen feelings, which is, it's gorgeous. I love it. But Juniper Breeze has that slighter, sweeter note to it, which is that green apple. Oh my God, I love this one so much. Juniper Breeze is banging, y'all. It is banging. Like, if you have not smelled it, get in store and smell it. Don't be afraid. Smell it. Because it's unlike anything else they've put out, in my opinion. Yeah. I like a lot. I like a lot. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, you guys, that is all my thoughts today on Juniper Breeze with comparison, review. I love it, in case you can't tell. And if you've tried Juniper Breeze, let me know what you think down below. Do you like it? Do you hate it? Because it seems like it's one way or the other. You either love it or you hate it. So I'm really curious to hear what you guys think and, and what your thoughts are on this. So yeah. But other than that, y'all, you know the drill. You know the drill. Like, comment, subscribe and if you have not subscribed yet y'all what the heck are you doing what the heck are you doing we are growing by leaps and bounds over here we just hit 3k the channel just hit 3k i'm so excited it hit it um the week this weekend i'm actually recording this on sunday and you guys probably won't see this till later in the week but yeah we hit uh 3k on saturday and i was just like yeah so I'm super excited about that. I love you guys so much. I genuinely do. Like, y'all mean the world to me. I can't even explain it. I really can't. So, but anyway, yeah, if you have not subscribed yet, now's your time to do so. Come on, join, uh, jump aboard the Merry Makers train. Let's do this. And uh, hit the bell so you guys are alerted every time I upload, y'all. I know a lot of y'all are subscribers, but you haven't hit that bell yet. You haven't hit that bell. All right, you guys, that's all I have for today. And I will catch you in the next one. All right, you guys. Bye-bye. Thank you.